Well, grab a drink and get a bite to eat. A brand new entertainment district around Allegiant Stadium is in the works. And thanks for joining us live on TV, Fire TV, or wherever you're streaming us right now. I'm Trisha Keen. And I'm Ty Quinones with Clark County Commissioners approving a plan to transform the area. And 13 Action News reporter Jeremy Chen now shows you what the county believes will attract more business. Expect to see a lot of visitors from out of town coming from the Strip to watch a game over at Allegiant Stadium. However, if you move over to the west of the stadium, that's where most locals will be coming through. I'm sure that if we're standing here five or six years from now, the landscape and, and what it looks like behind us will be very different. Raiders President Mark Bedane is expecting a very different area around Allegiant Stadium in the future. Clark County Commissioners approving a plan Wednesday night to create an entertainment district with bars, restaurants, and other retail. It would take up a one and a quarter square mile around the stadium and west of I-15. Hopefully we'll develop out as a, uh, a wonderful place for people to come, have some dinner, have a drink before the game, and hang out a little while afterwards. The focus? To create an area that would still attract people even when Allegiant Stadium isn't hosting an event. This would mean transforming this predominantly industrial area. But Dane says he believes new development will come. There's going to be a lot of investment in here. Uh, when these stadiums pop up, investment usually follows, activity usually follows. There are also plans to have public art and smaller blocks to make it easier for people to walk around. County Commissioner Michael Naft, whose district includes the stadium, is optimistic about the future development. I could see the west of the stadium being the locals area. That's where locals will come from and spend some time. While there's no definitive timeline for the plan, Commissioner Naft says he believes some improvements can be done as soon as possible, like adding bike lanes to the streets. Jeremy Chen, 13 Action News.